My name is Gijs, and together with my dad, I'm rebuilding the almost 80 year old sailing ship Tigerai. Currently, we are busy with installing a new wheelhouse because the old one was leaking and rotting away. Last week, we had the big day when the crane came to remove the main mast and the old wheelhouse and put the new wheelhouse in place. Having the new wheelhouse in position is actually only a small part of the complete replacement of the wheelhouse. To start off, the new wheelhouse is about 1.5 meters longer than the old one, which means we have to remove the engine room hatches and extend the deck from the old wheelhouse so we can walk around easily in the new wheelhouse. The cooling water expansion tank from the main engine and the generators is currently located in a place that will be inside the new wheelhouse which means draining it and removing it and later coming up with a new position for this tank Now that all engine room equipment is out of the way, it's time to make some new deck beams to extend the deck from the old wheelhouse. With the new deck beams and frames in place, we can straight away install new deck plating.
Now that we have a place to stand on, it's time to remove all the old remains from the old wheelhouse so that we can walk around freely in the new wheelhouse. Hey Dad, <laughs> can you tell us what you are doing? I'm cutting out the old shit. At least I'm trying to. There you go. So why you are cutting it out? Ah, because it's, it's going to be all nice and new. And painted. All right. Sounds like a plan. It is a plan. Since the top part from the A-frame that the main mast was standing on was removed, there's now a big hole in the deck from the wheelhouse where you can look straight down into the engine room. Later, this will be the emergency escape from the engine room, so we will reuse the old escape hatch and install it in the deck from the new wheelhouse. Before we can weld the new wheelhouse to the deck, we have to make sure the deck is clean and free of rust and all the old remains from the old wheelhouse are removed so that we have a smooth deck. Since the wheelhouse is new and made exactly according to drawing and the ship is old and built very fast during the second world war and has been modified a few times afterwards, these two don't exactly fit together. So we have to put the new wheelhouse down on deck measure all the gaps and then make filler pieces in order to put it straight on deck. 
with the wheelhouse down flat on deck, we noticed that the overhead space was quite small. So we decided to make the filler pieces that we had to make anyway about 10 centimeters high so that tall people can also stand up straight inside the wheelhouse. So it's on the correct position. Now we can start making the filler pieces and tack weld the complete wheelhouse to the deck. Alright, it's fully tack welded to the deck, now we can remove the support beams so that we can walk around freely in the new wheelhouse and start the major job of putting the final welding all the way around so that we can make the wheelhouse fully watertight. That's all for now, if you have any questions or advice please let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching. And I will see you next time.